Hey guys, Brad M73 here. Welcome back to Farm Expert 2016. Uh, today is September 1st, 2016. No, actually it's Farm Expert 2017. Sorry about that. Today is September 1st, 2016, and the game is now avail available for purchase. Uh, it runs 19.99, so pretty much where I thought it was going to be. I kind of thought to myself, if it's more expensive than that, I don't know how it's going to be a, a, a you know if it's going to be a success um unfortunately when the game updated i lost my save game and a lot of, as a lot of people pointed out in the comments the last video they're like brad you know you you halfway plowed this field here yeah i know and look at these i don't know if you can tell the the ruts in the um ground actually have tire marks in them which i think is pretty cool so you can see where I at least went back over this with the uh, uh, fertilizer. So I kind of tried to catch up to that point. Uh, so right now this field says it's 91% sown. I don't know why it dropped because it was less. There was more I think before. 100% plowed, 100% cultivated, um, and it's just got wheat. So we'll just grow wheat here, <clears throat> and then. I have the other guys working over here. Um, the guy off in the distance, he is still plowing. Uh, the guy here, he's actually cultivating at this point. And I wanted to actually go back and grab the cultivator. Where's my tractor? Here we go. Um, can I... You guys are like, why are you opening the doors? And uh, this is gonna sound really stupid, but I'm, I basically just opened up these doors so I could drive through and so that I wouldn't have to actually drive all the way around the front of the, the building. I know, I, I, you don't have to tell me guys, I know. Um. So I'm going to pick up this cultivator. I'm going to show you why. If there's one thing that this game does that I kind of don't like, it is... Uh, there we go. If there's one thing that I kind of don't like, it's that when you're plowing you leave these huge plow ruts at the end of the field because the 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 hired workers aren't very intelligent you can see these big huge ruts that you kind of you know go off-roading through which is quite annoying to me so oh and i don't want to i do not want to get caught in the creek bed there because yeah bad stuff happens Um, lower machine. And we're just going to go all out. We're going to try to de, de plow rut this thing. I don't know what other word you would use for it, but yeah, you get these huge ruts, which I guess would happen if you actually plowed real earth like this, or, or maybe not exactly like this, but it would be somewhat slightly similar, maybe. Come on, turn around. So I just want to smooth this out so the guy can turn around a little bit, e you know, more easily. I don't know if it's going to make a huge difference or not. It it might not. I don't know. I'm doing it for myself, not for you guys. No, what am I saying? I'm doing it all for you guys. I do it all for you. Um. So I mean, aside from that, I don't really see any major differences. Um, with the release candidate, only that I lost my save games. 
um, which kind of concerns me because I, I believe with Farming uh, Expert 2016, the one that came out last year, I'm pretty sure that every time they did an update, you lost your save games. Which <clears throat> really ticked me off. I think I, I I could be thinking of professional farmer, but I thought farming simulator, farm expert was like that too. I'm just hoping that it's not. I really am for for reasons which should be painfully obvious. And if it if it does do that, then it's basically going to make this impossible to do as a. Um, you know, a series. So I don't know. We'll see. Maybe I'll maybe I'll email my my contact and find out if uh, if he knows. But I haven't had any crashes yet, which is good. Um, I haven't had any any other major problems with the game. You know, running it. Um, it's running at 66 frames per second right now. Um, usually it runs higher than that when I'm not recording. Like, you know, it's usually like 80 to 100 frames a second. Sometimes way more than that. Uh, come on, nah. Come on, nah. Um, do I need... <clears throat> I'm seriously stuck. I'm stuck. I'm I'm literally stuck. Okay. Let's start her up. We're in gear 1A. It should be the highest RPM. Really? Wow. Um, well. Okay, I really, really super hope. Did that cost me money? Let's see, 49, 8. I think it costed me money. What are we at? 49,849. So we're going to have to have this thing go home. Yep. Costs me money when I get stuck. Yay! This makes me... This does not in any way exude greatness. <laughs> oh, come on, man. No. Go forward. Now go backward. Um, where am I? Oh, okay. No, go up. Great. <laughs> I just damaged my my driveway there. I hope I hope the wife doesn't find out. Oh, the other guy is finished, so let's go and go to employees and we're going to depute the other area over there. Okay, and let's just hope this time that we don't get stuck. Oh, I feel bad. We're, we're destroying the purdy little flowers. They're so purdy. Okay. Now we'll get stuck over here or something. <laughs> Come on, don't get stuck. Go, 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 go. Go. 
Go Landini! Uh, you know, it's it's a shame that they only got one Landini tractor licensed. Um, I would think that they had more, you know, Landini's got to have more than just one tractor, right? Right? Maybe they don't, I don't know. I'd never really heard of Landini before this, so I don't know if they're, like, where in the world. I, you know, I'm not, like, a farmer. I just, I just play one on YouTube. <laughs> um... Yeah, I'm like not a farmer, so I don't really know too much about this stuff. I know John Deere and Case and stuff like that, mainly because of Farming Simulator. But that's that's about my limit of farming knowledge. If I can, uh, just gonna go down this field here. Now, the other thing, too, is I don't think that the hired workers will work around, um, like, like for example, if I already, whoops, come on now, if I've already uh, cultivated this area, I do not think he'll, he'll go and just ignore it. I think he just goes right back over it, you know, again. So um, I'm going to cultivate this, and then we'll we'll kind of wait around for a second and see. The other thing I wanted to do this episode is go and buy um, the cow farm, which unfortunately is going to take longer in this episode than I thought it was going to take because uh, we have to go back to the um, the bank and get another loan. All right, so we're we're coming alongside. The cultivating is pretty much going to be finished up at this point. I can see one little strip where I missed the uh, cultivating. And you you will see he's just going to turn around and he's going to keep on going. Whoops. No. Bring him up. Move. There we go. Yeah, so he's going to keep on going. Um, I think I'm going to take... What is this? Is this a vehicle? Oh, yeah, it's a vehicle garage. Yeah, so he's just... You know, he's going to keep on going, doing his thing. The other thing I have not tried out is whether or not I can have two vehicles working on the field at the same time. Set that down. Close this down. So since he's still going, I am going to, let's see, wheat on this field, this field, in this field work has already started. So yeah, you have to wait until the field is completely finished before you, you know, before we can go back and actually hire He's probably going to go back up that way one more time, but I don't know. Maybe he won't. Yep. So, yeah, like for this bigger field here, it's going to take longer because, you know, he's got a much larger field to work on and... <laughs> yeah, see, he's not even, he doesn't even care. He's not even got his tool lowered. He's just driving up the the field. Um, they they really need to, to work on the AI. Um, okay, he should disappear in a second. All 
I hope. You rotate. Come on now. Nah. Get off my field. I don't know, maybe it's gonna take... Oh, there he goes. Maybe I had to look away. It's like one of those things where you have to actually look away for the vehicle to despawn. So now we got this guy. Whoa, what's going on out here? Oh, there we go. And he is going to get started planting wheat, I guess. Um, oddly, the vehicles don't make any noises, so there's another potential bug. I don't know if that... Um, I hadn't noticed that before. That is kind of annoying. Okay, so. The only bank is way over here. So. Off we go. <clears throat> what I'm going to do, though, just to save time and to save your guys' patience as well as mine. I'm gonna just time-lapse this. Uh, we're just gonna go to the bank, we're gonna get the maximum loan like we did in the last episode, and then I'm going to drive down to the cattle farm where we will buy the cattle farm. How does that sound to you guys? Okay, so we're here at the animal husbandry farm. Ooh, got everything here. So we're gonna enter by the farm, and I guess I'll shut the tractor off here. And we're gonna kind of have a look around at uh, what everything does. So this is the tank for manure. Uh, hopefully we have doors that do not open. That's a shame. Is this door? Oh man, come on, man! You can't. You got. If you make some of the doors open, you got to make them all open. That's the that's the way games work, guys. There's the Euro pallets over there. Uh, let's see what's this. This is farm for sheep and goats. Building the building main manager poultry. Whoa, this really looks rough in here. Where's the cows? I need to find the cows. Okay, ho this is probably gonna be horses over here. Tank for green, okay. Horses. And cows. All right, so. Um, let's see, Am aminals. Oh, we need to, wait, where do we go to purchase? Cows. I can, I can only buy five, see, hay stored. Okay, weather station. We're gonna own or buy ducks, chickens. Might as well buy everything. Okay, so we got everything we can buy. Now, uh oh. What happened? Oh, phew. Like, the game just froze for a second, and I almost pooped a little bit. I was like, <gasps> no! No! <laughs> Dang, man, look, those udders look really... 
Those are some pink. Well, that cow is just. Wow. <laughs> Looks like it's ready for something, and I'm not going to go into what. Um, okay, so main villain for cows. Um. Building. There we go. Current level one allows for breeding. Whoa, that's expensive. We're going to upgrade the cow shed. Man, these are freaking expensive. Um, now, we also need to buy feed, I think, for the... For the different guys, right? Meh. Oh. What? Like, what's wrong with this back leg? Oh my god, there's conjoined twins! Oh man, I missed him standing up. I think that would have been really hilarious to see. Okay, I'm going to buy this for the poultry. Um, I don't know how quickly the cows will reproduce. That's the only... That's the only thing that I don't really know. And I have to go back to my home area. Alright, so I'm going to let these guys go. Um, I should be able to manage all of the functions uh, from within the uh, the game or you know from within the, the game menu and let's uh, let's just head back up to the main farm really quick or we'll kind of see how things are going up there <clears throat> do I own any more fields as I don't think so okay Now, I probably don't have enough money to buy even a used combine at this point, so we're going to be hiring workers to, to combine our fields, and then uh, we'll just go around with the, um, the wagon and offload those, and uh, you know we can sell directly, um, but hopefully this you know we'll be making the majority of our money off of livestock. Um, early on. That's typically kind of how farms work anyway. Man, that guy's still not finished cultivating. So, I tell you what I'm going to do, guys. I'm, I'm going to end the episode here, but um, we'll come back. All these fields will be planted and, uh, you know, cultivated and we'll kind of move forward with the uh you know seeing how we can make money on a daily basis because once i get everything you know we we're, he's finishing up cultivating over there he's finishing up seeding there um i don't have a seeder i don't really want to buy one at this point ah camera um i don't really want to buy one at this point because it's way cheaper for me to hire somebody else to uh do the work and once I get these fields fertilized and growing, then we can kind of work on the minutia of uh, managing the the animals a bit better. So we'll be back in the next episode for that. Thank you so much, guys, for watching and hanging out with me once again. This has been Farm Expert 2017. As always, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. I'm Bradham73. We'll see you guys next time. Bye for now.